Hello, Georgia B back again. I am feeling a little bit stronger today. So I've decided to do a little bit of filming. Um, today's card, I have made this using the stamp set Word of Cheers. Cheer. And today I'm going to use that image and the word Christmas. That's it. I have got a card base of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths, scored at four and one eighth, folded in half. I have a piece of uh, so succulent from the new ink colours, and that bit. Not cut right. That's it. And that is five and five eighths by three and seven eighths. I also got a scrap of crumb cake, a scrap of mossy meadow, a scrap of white, and the white piece of five and five eighths by three and seven eighths for the inside. And I've already stamped that, and it says wishing you a joyful Christmas. And that will go on the in fact we might as well put it on now and this goes on the inside I had a pile of these already stamped out and this is actually the last one so the rest of the cards are filmed today I will have to stamp the middle bits right so Let's place that up there so I can see what I'm going to do. This idea actually come from Pinterest. I can't remember the name of the person. Let's see if I've still got it. Such a pretty card. Um, find my cards now where I saved. There it is. Holiday card by hmm. There is no name. Stamping up cards. It's a picture. Hello, hello day cards. I presume that's who it is. That's where I got this idea from. So, put that to one side. And we're going to work on this. And we are going to heat and boss our image on here. Which is the flower. Which I've already got on a block. We need to bring out our embossing body and give the whole card a swipe with the embossing body. Put it away. We've got our. Oh, that's fine. Now we're going to ink up this stamp and ink it really well put something on there that's it that's it on me Stamp. Must be coming off my pad. Looks like I'm going to have to get the new pad out. Right, and I'm stamping this to the side. Got my um, 
blocks need a really good clean. Now this stamp, uh, this card, I made before I got ill. In fact, I haven't made any more cards since I started filming. Right, how did I? That flower there, I'm going to put to the top. So I've turned it round and I'm going to stamp it this side now. Right. And we'll get some white embossing powder. And Scoop. And we're going to cover our image with white embossing for powder. Lovely. Put the lid back on that. Get rid of any powder on there. And we're going to heat up this egg, uh, heat gun. I'm just going to heat underneath first. all heated up so we'll just leave that to cool now and get on with the rest of our stuff now I've walked this never mind put that to one side and now we want to cut out don't need that no more um, cut out our happy and stamp our Christmas and everything. Now I'm using the dies from the set. So what we're going to do is cut out our happy on this one. A background happy. There's our foreground happy on there. And then these little leaves or twigs we're going to cut out on there. And I am going to use my Kitsukum Boodle new one. Where's my plates here? So, put the word happy there. It's on. And put this word happy. And we're going to Cut them both out. I forget that it's so long. I need room in front of me. So there's the word happy. 
and sorry about that that was the postman or Amazon delivery with new padlocks had a new gate fitted yesterday and we needed a padlock for it right so I've cut the screen out and the white we will glue to sit on there like that I think that looks really pretty so that can go in the bin I'll keep that because I want to stamp Christmas out right and we've got these leaves to cut out how many did I cut out oh just one of each so put any tape on this kit and caboodle thing yet because I've not taped anything down. Right, now we've got three twigs. Right, that's that done. got our six little twigs which will keep to the side. Right, I'm now going to glue this white happy onto the green happy. I will use this um, die, happy die, for happy birthday. All you've got to do is cut off the twig bits here, which I plan on doing. I don't care if it's been retired. That's the way I feel at the moment. They're retiring things far too quick. Yes, I've got to make room for their other new things, but as I'm not, as I'm, I'm just a hobby demonstrator, I am going to start using retired stuff when I want to. Right, um, so that's that done, that's that done. We just need to stamp our Christmas, so I'm going to stamp it along the bottom. Got some mossy meadow. I've got the word Christmas upside down, and I'm going to stamp that there. everywhere. Let's do that again. It's got like a little star on the S, uh, C. So that's better. Right, that's that clean. My finger sort of cleaned. Cover that up. Right, we want to cut this Christmas.
There we are. There's our nice Christmas cup. Throw that in a bit. And keep that. Never know when you want it. Right, so that's our decorations done. So let's glue this onto here. I'm going to put some extra glue on this because it has been embossed. lump of ink there keep that for scrap so a little green mark on my card. Let's just get it off. That'll do. So that's my card top down and now we're going to put this flat but what I'm going to do is get my branches Oh, the two different types. There, one's got like a twig, and one's got like the round edges. Don't know if you'll see that. Hang on. Like that. So I'm gluing one of each together. Now, I'll just. Put that and I'm going to put them down, one there, and one each there. And the last one I'm going to put underneath the happy. And they're going to go under the P. And then this I will just glue down flat. Make sure it's straight. There we are. And our Christmas, which I'll put here, 
I'm going to put on dimensionals. Using the small ones. Just use four. off and I'm going to put this just under the P and the Y all we've got left to do is put some gems on, the, on. so we're going to put two there two here one here. Got to have an odd one. Two there. And two here. So I do like putting glue down because I'm fed up of, when I go back to my cars later with the heat of the room they do come unstuck so I put glue on I put glue down just to make sure that they don't come unstuck and it works and I'm not bothered about if the glue squirts out around the edges because it dries matte not shiny you can't see it and it's clear so that is my card for today hope you like it if you do give us a thumbs up if you'd like to see more of my cards please subscribe and if you press the bell button you'll be notified of any more videos I upload which is usually a Monday, Wednesday and Friday but at the moment till I recover they're just Monday and Fridays and I think it'll be like that until after Christmas so all I can say is thanks for visiting and I hope to see you again soon